the bullet out. Please tell me who you are, don't creep me out. He kind of scared me by the way, I was like, what the fuck? Is that the same glitch from the, I mean, the same, oh god. Get the shrapnel out. Me? The same okay, easter egg stop. from the first season, uh, the third season I mean. Okay, hold on, I need to save the clip. God damn it. Okay. I, the last time we did this, I did this with Sam. Oh, I was not Clementine. I was Michonne. Trying not to be loud. It's okay, AJ. Just breathe. Put your hands there. Stop the bleeding. It's okay, AJ. He's just gonna patch you up. Oh. It's enough. For now. Easy, easy. Wait, 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 wait. Stuff. My gun. We lost it, buddy. Lewis and Violet ran. They're safe. Yeah, probably. It sucks. You. Who the fuck are you? If you're supposed to be a character we know, then who the hell are you? If you are a character we know. I didn't mean to endanger you. The walkers were sent to help you. you really? Sent the walkers? I was part of a group. Called themselves Whisperers. They've learned to live in herds, among walkers, move among them, sometimes guide them. Why are you alone, if you were part of a group? They attacked a community, saw the carnage, and didn't want to be part of it. Oh, does it hurt? Of course it Holy. does. said it been a while is your name what what glit who the James James why did you help us James <gasps> okay that is that she attacked you what do you know about them I know they steal kids. They took two last year. A common practice for them. Is that James, the kid They're from uh, Michelle? Their entire community against another. 
It's why they take people. To make them fight. Train them. Use them. You would join their war. Okay, the, the question is, is that James, the little kid from uh, yes. Michonne? That's why I helped you. I don't think so. I thought it was Glenn for a sec. Thank you. <laughs> because he said it's been a while. Clem? Wait. Throw it. Distract him. Works just as well. And nobody gets hurt. Not us. Not him. That guy is a weirdo, kind of. But he saved my life. Thank you. Oh no, I'm thinking about difficult. it. Why did Lois and Violet return to, to us? There was a gunshot. I didn't want them to die. So, James, do you just hang around in the woods, saving random people? After I left my group, I wandered. First time alone, ever. Saw war everywhere. First against walkers, then against each other. Hoped it would be better here. Where are you from? Here? Or somewhere far away? Georgia. Long way from home. It feels like forever ago. It was. So, where are you from? Washington. The city or the state? The city. Dad ran a food truck. I helped. No, I don't think it's James from Michonne. You've got a fever. His wound will need proper cleaning. From Michonne, his, his dad was a if lawyer you're lucky or something. The school has medicine, but I don't think they'll share it. That's why those people attacked you, isn't it? To get to that school. They'll destroy whatever they find. Bring more guns, more fighters. Take everyone inside. They won't be able to fight them off. You need medicine. You have to go back, or you'll lose him. I'll go back. Convince them to help AJ. They'll take us back once they see him. They wouldn't turn AJ away. You hope? I'll help you get back. That's Ask the, the calmest guy I've ever seen in the whole four hours, seasons. <laughs> That's a few hours for you to sleep. <sighs> I'll stay awake. You don't have to. Sleep. I'll keep watch. Mm, I can't. Then we'll both keep watch. Less lonely. True. I, I trust him, but I wanna... I, I don't know. I didn't mean to, like, I'll keep watch with you. I want, I want him to rest, then I'll keep watch. Who knows, maybe he'll be disappointed because I say, oh, okay, he was gonna tell me, like, don't trust people that easily. Maybe, who knows. Are we gonna fish? Is 
Is he awake? Yeah. He's so hot. I can carry him. You're exhausted. No. I've got him. It will give me a choice, I would say, okay, because I trust him. There's the traps. Hang on, we're almost there. Walker! Holy shit! Violet, Lewis, they came back. Okay, that costume is not safe, dude. Get it off. You live out there alone, right? You could stay with us. Not ready. Oh my god, do they know him? Do they know him and kicked him out or something? He said not ready. I bet, I bet he is. He seems like a teenager or something. I can't no. keep carrying you. We'll be inside soon. Rest now. Shit. Is he... Uh... He's alive. He was shot. He's got a fever. Come on, let's get him inside. I can't. Okay, buddy. I got you. I guess this is happening to me because I hadn't sleep, I guess. I have been sleeping. So, I'm pretty goddamn sure James is one of the members of the school, but he left or something. But... Maybe in the meantime, maybe Marlon let let them take him or something. Then he ran away. See. Is Ruby the I doctor? What I need upstairs. Come on. I guess Ruby is a doctor of this group. We got the shrapnel out of him. We? It's a long story. Okay. About the explanation. Body's trying to fight infection, poor little guy. Ruby and Lewis will take care of him. You come with me. We can talk in the office. And Clem, shh. You just try to rest, okay? We're gonna fix you right up. Clem. What do you want, little goofball? AJ, listen to Ruby, okay? She'll look after you. Come on. What do we do when we're scared? When fear starts to get the upper hand. We push. We don't let it take over. I'm good now. Clementine, please. We need to talk. out in the woods I saw they had you pinned and I Shit, I got so crazy when I heard you call for help I didn't even think I wanted to help you but when you told us to run I had to trust you yeah that's okay thank you for protecting us he was really brave I really thought you were dead Clem It's just everything is so fucked right now, you know? Everyone is scared, Clem. 
Sorry to disappoint. You'll have to put up with us for a while longer. No disappointment here. I'm glad you came back. Huh. Well, what about Mitch? And the others? Oh, uh, well, they're less excited about it. Lewis and I told them what I think Ruby is fine with it. That woman who attacked you. Lily. So you do know her. We were wondering. Who the hell is she? I mean, I know you're not, like, with her group, but the others don't like the coincidence. Her showing up right after you? I mean... Lily and I were friends a long time ago. Friends? Back when the walkers first showed up, we lived in a motor inn. Survived really awful shit. Lily tried to keep us all together. Looks like she's changed. Yeah, seems that way. She murdered someone in our group, gunned them down during an argument. Carly was her name. She refused to let Lily push her around. It was right at the start. I haven't seen Lily since. I believe you. But? There's something else. Lily said someone was with you at the gates. James. He saved me and AJ. Let us stay in his camp for the night. But why did you bring him here? You led him right to us. I mean, he's a stranger, Clem. Running into those two in the woods, it proved we can't trust anybody. Look, he's not with the raiders. He lives by himself in the woods. Willie said he was wearing, I don't know, animal skins or something. <laughs> oh, I thought he he'd know they know him. Walker skin. That's how he gets past herds. He can guide them too. <sighs> wow. Who knows? Maybe he lied about his name. He said I James. I would have brought him here if I thought he was a threat. It's not that I don't trust you. I'm just worried about the others and what they might do. They didn't even get a chance to mourn Brody and Marlin before these child-snatching assholes showed up. And then you two come back after we thought you were dead. Now they're confused and no one knows how to feel about AJ. Violet, AJ is the least of their worries. I know, but everything is such a mess. They're scared and angry and they're looking for someone to blame. I mean, they kicked you out. How am I supposed to make them change their minds about you? It was decided. Five to three against. I know it feels like it shouldn't matter, but they were afraid of you. Both of you. You don't have to. Let me convince them. James told me what Lily and Abel will do next. He said they'll get more people and guns and come attack us. Take everyone here. How the hell would he know? He's watched them for a while. They're at war with another community. They take people to fight for them. Is that what happened to Minnie and Sophie? They turn them into soldiers? Yeah, it'll happen to us too if we don't stop them. And he didn't even like killing walkers. Look at this place. It's a fortress. What place? With a little work. We could make this place really hard to attack. Do you actually know how to do that? Yeah. I was part of a siege once in a town called Richmond. Oh. Here, let me show you. We've got good strong walls. We need to make them hard to climb over, so the raiders have to come in through the gates. We used to keep barbed wire in the greenhouse. This is where we should make our stand. There's only one way in, the front. And then there's the big central staircase. If we rig that path with traps, we can pull back here. Luring in our attackers. I like it. The courtyard's pretty wide open. Not a lot of cover. We should flip the picnic tables, narrow down the pathways through it. So we'll know which way they're coming. At the very least, it'll give us protection if they get past these walls. I was about to ask, how the hell Clem... No, about defending a place, and I remember, th I mean, well, uh, yeah, I remember that she was in Richmond. Anymore, do you? She was a member in no, Richmond. No, we used to. Then we lost someone out there. Walkers overran the place, and Marlon wouldn't let us go back. <laughs> Safe zone. We need to get that barbed wire so they can't climb the walls. I'll go. Are you sure? It's gonna be swarming with walkers by now. Okay, what the hell's going on? Oh, come on, Mitch, you fucking she dickhead. Back. But I was like, no way. Violet wouldn't just go against what we all decided. Shh. Would you keep it down? 
the little boy's asleep. His fever's already going down, Clem. He's gonna be okay. Oh, thanks, Ruby. Great. We're just giving them our medicine, too? Mitch, those raiders are getting ready to attack the school. We need Clem's help. Like hell we do. For all we know, she's one of them. What? She's not. If you saw their leader's boot on Clem's neck, you'd know that. Use your head, Mitch. You saw AJ on your way in. If I was with the Raiders, why would they have hurt him like that? How do I know? Maybe he shot one of their friends. Mitch! Clem's going to the greenhouse to find barbed wire and anything else she thinks we need for the fight, and you're going to help her. Uh, no, I'm not. Yes, you are. It's too dangerous for her to go by herself, and you're good in a fight. I can go too. You know, to keep the peace. Oh Fuck god, I want Ruby here because Ruby is the doctor. Calls. Since no one else stepped the fuck up. These two will meet you at the gate, and you can head to the greenhouse once I've explained the situation. See you there. So that's a cool idea, Violet. Making Mitch come with me. I. He likes AJ, no matter what. Even if he shot Marlin. I guess I didn't realize how long it's been. How much it's changed. Hold up. So I like how they like letting us get no Ruby and uh, Mitch. Uh, this ain't budging. You gonna stand there sulking all day? You gonna do something useful? Well, we need that barbed wire. There must be another way in. Okay, there must be a collectible around here. Talk to Ruby. Are you okay? It's been so long since I was here. I used to love this place. But it's so overgrown. I'll be fine. Let's just find a way in. <laughs> I like how they said collectibles can't be fine in this world. Oh, what the hell? Wild boar. Not too many in these parts, but they were more common where I grew up. I used to hunt them with my old man when I was little. They make <laughs> terrible noises when they die. I like Ruby. Well, She's I on can, our side. Look good on my wall. But she was the most one who creeped out about Marlin. But that's fine. He was one of them. So I must get used to know uh, Omar now. What do you want? Uh, nothing. You're only here because we're desperate, you know. So don't get comfy. If we survive these raiders, you and I are going to have words. Let's survive Fine. first. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> mm, I can't see shit. Well, there's too much condensation on the inside. Condensation? That's a big word for you. Shut up. The ladder. Looks like there's nothing but, but a ladder. That window. I bet we can get in there. Good spot. Mitch, come here and give me a boost. Wait. Make her go first. We send the one we don't mind losing. Fine, you That's asshole. That's an ugly thing to say. I'll go first. I don't mind. Figured you'd fight it. Thanks, Clem. 
holler if one grabs you. Otherwise, we'll come as soon as you give the all clear. I guess we'll know when the door opens. Oh god, there are walkers in there. Can you run, Clem? Oh god. God damn, that's a lot of walkers. Ruby is always getting scared, holy shit. But I respect that. Not bad. <laughs> oh look. Wild ginger. I don't know why James kinda looked like uh Jerusalem artichoke. Mitch. False Solomon seal. <laughs> Let's find that barbed wire and anything else that might be useful. Anything else might be useful. Okay, that's not true. Really. You seem happy. You can only eat the same bland rabbit stew so many times before you go crazy. These herbs are going to do wonders for morale. You wait and see. Let's hope we were surviving the fight first, okay? Did you find anything? What do you think? Okay, just asking. You know, the barbed wire idea is smart, I'll give you that. Those assholes try and climb our walls, they'll tear their guts out. I kind of like to see that. Find something? Yep, maybe useful. This just reminds me of Kenny. <laughs> Shovel. Could be a weapon. Or use it to dig a grave. You weren't there when we dug the holes for Marlin and Brody. We had to use cups and bowls. It took forever. Are there any collectibles around? Really? So there is no collectibles? Mushroom. Some mushrooms are edible. What if I died <laughs> when I ate mushrooms? I don't even know, they might be poisonous. So I'm not gonna do that. Maybe it's a death scene. I got a feeling it's a death scene. No, I don't want to eat mushrooms, thank you. Yes! Dibs! Okay, I need to, I thought I need to press X multiple times, but okay. Barbed wire. A lot of it too. That should keep the raiders from climbing our walls. Hey, we can use these. For what? We can make bombs out of these. 
Bombs? Are you serious? <laughs> totally. It's the kind of stuff I made back home. He used to blow shit up. That's why he's a troubled youth. Guilty. This guy is from Minecraft. He also used to craft stuff. To spark, and we'll have ourselves a nice little homemade explosive. That's useful, actually. <clears throat> Remember right, there's a science lab through that door. Maybe there's propane in there. Come on, help me move this thing. <laughs> okay, let's see what's inside. How did the walkers got in? Of course. Can you help me, Mitch? Rose! What's going on? You alright? We well, had a scare, that's all. She know her? Who was she? Miss Martin. Our nurse at the school. Oh. She stayed when all the others left. God. So that's how she, she knew was. how to fix uh, bandages and stuff from her. I bet. I can barely recognize her she's just just like all the others I'm sorry Ruby I, I just wish I could make her look like she used to one day we came out looking for food walkers attacked us thought we could fight them off but there were just there were so many Ms. Martin told us to run so we did she taught me how to patch people up. Yeah. Stitching, local anesthetics, painkillers, fever reducers. I don't think I can take care of her. Would you? I'm sorry. Of course I can. Don't worry about it. Dude, she got Are cut in half. Life? Holy yeah. fuck. Just need a minute. Come on, guys. Help me find that propane and we can get out of here. Why do you look like you don't give a shit? Marlin didn't tell me that there was someone left. He told me that all the adults left. Still a liar, I guess. Mitch, is this useful? Fucking A. I was hoping there'd be one of those. That's an igniter. We can use it to create a spark. Now we just have to find propane. We can blast those motherfuckers to hell. Swear. Okay, sorry to let you do that, Clem. Oh, let me talk to them you first. You seem to know a lot about bombs. I made my first one when I was eight. Really? I blew up the garage. It was awesome. Though, Dad didn't think it was awesome. Yeah, because Dad it's gave not. Me a chemistry set to keep from fighting the neighbors. Uh, why would you fight the neighbors? I had a lot of energy. I had to use it somehow. 
And they didn't like my face. Oh yeah, I need to think those there there must be a collectible around here. Oh, let me talk to Ruby. Ms. Martin meant a lot to you, huh? She was the only one who stayed. She saw us for what we were. A bunch of kids who no one wanted. She loved us when nobody else did. Like, really loved us. Yeah, I've known people like that. I guess everyone has. Ugh, looks like piss. Dare you drink it? Not in a million years. Wimp. Okay, I think Mitch is being fine with me right now. Oh, that's a collector, I think. No, he w it will bite your butt, Clem. <laughs> oh, I got a trophy for that. Hmm, let's hope there's gas in it. What? Yeah, perfect. Here. Good, fine. Now we have everything we need. We should get back and tell the others. We have to bury Ms. Martin first. Bury her? Why bother? It's a walker. Help me drag it out back. We draw a little it. kid in the first season, it's fine. Ms. Martin's the reason we're all alive. We didn't even know the kid and we buried him, so it's he fine by me. a proper burial here. Next to the greenhouse she loved. That way the others won't have to see her like this. She's been dead for years. There's no point. Burn it, she bury her. a real burial. I'll help you bury her. It's the right thing to do for someone you cared about. Thank you so much. It's not a her. It's a walker. Fine, whatever. I'm not wasting my energy on that thing. God. I'll put a stone in the graveyard. Back at the school. Bet Ms. Martin loved this place. She'll be happy here. I'll make sure everyone knows you helped me. That you've got a... a good heart. Under all that muck. <laughs> hey. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I know Ruby is nice since the first time I saw her. Since the first time I saw her, she was kind of mad. Think it'll be enough? <sighs> Hopefully. And it means Lily and her people won't be able to climb the walls. They'll have to come through the gates. We can plan for that. Straight into a fiery explosion of death. Assholes won't know what hit them. Huh. I completed Act 2. Oh, that's a version of the music from Season 1. I don't know what it's called, the music. Hold up. Oh, he's sleeping. Didn't collect a lot of collectibles, damn it. Wait, I didn't finish. Oh, no. Lois. Brought you these. I noticed his shirt got messed up when, you know. Where did you get those? They were tens back when he got here. Should be about AJ's size. How's he doing? Better. His fever's down. Thank you for carrying him in. No problem. Aww. So, we've got a greenhouse again. And bombs. Mitch's idea. I figured. Violet says we'll start getting this place ready in the morning. Good. They all seem okay with letting you stay. For now, anyway. Huh. While we get ready to fight. I wish they'd decided that before AJ got shot and nearly killed. Well, you're here now. And safe. Everyone else is okay with us staying. What about you? 
It's fine. Well, he gets better. Oh, and shut up. That? I don't know, Clementine. Clem? Hey, kiddo. How do you feel? Better. It still hurts. I know. Hi, Louis. Hey, little dude. I missed you. Are we friends again? Just get some sleep, okay? Oh, come on, Louis. Louis? I really missed you. <laughs> missed you too. Good night. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that I just did, but I did it. I'm not mad at him anymore. Are you? He helped carry me, and he was by my bunk when Ruby gave me stuff. AJ, I was never mad at him. I understand why he acted that way, why he wanted us gone. <sighs> me too. Let's get a look at the shirts Lewis brought you. Then we'll sleep. It's been a long day. Yeah. No bullet holes. Nope. Was it time to put the collectibles? Yeah, I didn't collect much. I wonder how long it'll last. Nice. Oh, I want AJ's reaction on these stuff. Pretty cool. I can only collect the That's two stuff. That's a weird plant. It's a fungus. A fungus? Mushroom. Doesn't look fun. Why it's... Is it called a fungus too? I don't even know. Open door? No. Oh, why can't I put my dear skull up there if I didn't put it in the first place? That's weird. Look at the shirts. Hmm. It's only show, okay. How about this one? It looks like Tin's boots. Oh yeah, I think it's the same character. Cool. Hey, this one's pretty cool. Mm, looks like Marlin's jacket. Oh, yeah, but it would still look good on you. Hey, look, it's Disco Broccoli and his friend. <laughs> I'll choose this one. I wish you could have seen this cartoon. Me too. Hmm, this one will work. Of course, I'm going to give you him this one. You can put it on when you feel better, okay? Yeah. Time for sleep. I can't sleep with the light. I'll blow it out in a second. Can I talk to AJ? No. Light trap. Oh, I didn't put that. Thank God, I remember. So I collected three stuff. Personal touch. I got a trophy. Hold on. Okay, that's so cool. I collected all of the collectibles in episode two. That's amazing. Wait. Why did I want to try and track the door for the first time? This... Disco Broccoli. That plant looks scary. Oh, it is. <laughs> it's a fly trap. It eats bugs. A plant can eat bugs? <laughs> That's so, so awesome. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let a walker bite. And if it tries... Bang. <sighs> bang. <laughs> I know what this is. It shows in the first trailer. I know what this is. Oh, 
Wait, what? More than days now? More than one day? Two weeks later, holy shit!